Hello everyone, thank you for watching Mad Trucks with Marcos and today we have an awesome truck. It's a 2017 Ford F-250. It's got the power stroker in it and this one was built by 777 Customs uh, and it got an awesome wheel and tire package from Soda with some Toyo tires, uh, great suspension from BDS and um, it's just now it's, uh, it's the truck that it really should be. So we're going to go through it and uh, we're going to check it out. Alrighty guys, so again, thank you for watching. If you could uh, go ahead and subscribe to our channel, and uh, if you haven't already, check out all of our custom trucks at cunuscountrytrucks.com. Um, all right, so as I mentioned, this is a 2017, uh, it's an F-250 with the Power Stroker engine, so it is a diesel. Um, and uh, yeah, this one does have the Lariat package on it, so it's got the leather seats, heated, cooled, you know, it's got all that stuff on it. Um, most of these trucks, if you're gonna buy a truck and do something like this, I mean, some people do start with uh, more of a basic truck, but a lot of people do want all the bells and whistles, so this one has all the bells and whistles. And then uh, the goal with this build was to keep it really nice and clean. Uh, this one is gonna be for sale at our uh, Ford Antioch location. And uh, the idea with this one is it's, it's set up to where most people are gonna want it. If someone wants to add a bumper, they can do that. If someone wants to add some LEDs, we can do that. Um, but really, it's, it's where most people are gonna wanna start. Um, so it's got, uh, this is actually a four inch suspension lift from BDS. Uh, a, a lot of half ton trucks, we do a six inch lift. The three quarter tons and the one tons, since they already sit up so much higher than the half tons from the factory, most of the time we only do a four inch lift. Um, it, it's, I mean, it's, a, it's still a big truck. Um, so you get four inches of lift out of the suspension and then uh, wheels and tires, you're getting some more lift out of there. So, I mean, you probably end up getting about six inches of lift, but from the suspension, uh, you're only getting four inches of it. Um, so yeah, going with BDS is really nice. Um, it's a little hard to see, but you do get new radius arms, um, which they kind of just uh, get the geometry of that axle uh, and everything back to where they should be. Um, and then going with BDS, we can upgrade directly to the Fox shocks, which you can also see there. Um, just, uh, it's definitely a premium shock and when you're doing a truck like this to have Fox shocks on them and the BDS stuff that's warrantied for life is awesome. Going down the road, this truck, uh, it tracks really straight. Um, even with the mud tires on it, it's super quiet in the cabin was one thing I noticed when I was driving it. Um, typically you expect a little bit of noise uh, in the cabin from the tires, but they were really quiet on the way over. Um, so yes, wheels and tires. Uh, this is a premium wheel and tire package and basically um, it's got a 35 inch tall by 12 and a half inch wide on a 20 inch wheel. It's a Toyo Open Country MT. Uh, as far as mud tires go, Toyos are uh, at the top of the board. Um, they do a great mud tire. One, it looks really nice. Um, on a truck like this, you obviously want it to look a little beefier. Um, one thing I really like about the Toyos is the sidewall. Uh, if you wanted to air these down and actually go off-roading, uh, I mean, this tire is actually going to do, it's going to do its job really well. Um, you see these side lugs here, which are going to catch on from the side. Um, also on the street, this, the sidewall is going to protect uh, the wheel from many curbs that you might hit. Um, and then up here, um, you know, it's got the really wide lugs for mud, so it digs into the mud and then it flings it out so it doesn't get stuck in the tire and uh, it just, it keeps moving and it's going to keep this truck going in uh, pretty much all situations. But yeah, so the tire, premium tire there with the Toyo um, onto the wheels. So this is a, a soda off-road wheel. Um, they, they make a lot of really good looking wheels and uh, they don't really, uh, the pictures online or wherever you're looking at them, they're, they're not going to do them justice. Um, in real life, uh, I mean, they just, they look awesome. So it's mostly black. It's got like a polished black look and then it has a lot of the milled accents. This truck does have a lot of polish on it being a Lariat package. So having some of that pop on the wheel is nice. We see a lot of them that are completely blacked out, which works a lot of times, but in this scenario, if we were gonna go completely black with the wheels, we would have had to done a lot of body work, um, which didn't necessarily wanna do on this truck. So really nice wheel. It's a 20 inch tall, it's a 10 inch wide wheel. Um, and then uh, it's got our, like a neutral uh, offset. So it's right around zero on the offset. So tires do stick out a little bit from the fender wells. Most people like that. Um, like I said, we left it at a pretty clean slate. So if somebody wants to add flares to it, we can add flares and it's not gonna look goofy. Um, it's kind of um, right, right where you want it. 
so you can see how much they stick out uh, with that zero offset. Um, so yeah, um, suspension, wheels, tires, and then uh, last nice finishing touch, um, as far as the big stuff, would be the Amp Research Power Board. You can see how much farther down it comes down uh, than where a factory step would be. Since the whole truck got lifted, if you had factory running boards on there, they're going to be a lot higher than the factory location ones. And uh, these, they drop down really nice. And um, yeah, when you close the door, they go up there hidden away. The truck has that really clean, sleek look we were going for. Um, but when you need them, they pop out and they're there. Uh, so really nice there. And then a couple other just little things we did to it. Uh, it does have a stubby antenna on it uh, on the front here. Um, just kind of takes away the normal antenna that it would have. And then uh, we also tinted the front windows to match the rear windows. Uh, on this truck, that's just uh, it's the right thing to do. Um, so yeah, if you have any questions about this truck, please let us know. Like I said, it is for sale at our Ford of Antioch location. And uh, it's a brand new 2017. You buy it, bring it back to us with any problems. Uh, you're, so you're not going to have to worry about it. So it's a nice turnkey experience. Uh, and if you want to set up a test drive, uh, please, please give us a call. Thank you for watching, guys. Have a great day.